can just go back. Okay, so they scheduled you for three nights. So last night, tonight, and tomorrow night. We have nothing of interest. Give healing. Right up until your shift ended? Wait, were you told to work an extra shift on top of your normal shift? This is what that sounds like it's going to. Oh, I hate that. Like, not eat, like, no call, no show. <sighs> New swaps picked. Ooh, I get to pick a few of them, but Greedent gets swapped here, and then... Greedent goes to slot four. Scuda. Three. Dreadnought gets swapped into slot 15, which is Boltoned. And then Dreadnought also gets swapped here. Yeah, okay. Now, lots of. I am sorry for you, Blizzard Tails. Are you also being in, are you also expected to work tonight? Still? Are they going to pay you the overtime? Like, there are some small things. Okay, so you don't have to work tonight. And you don't have to be on over and you're not so you're you don't have to work the extra hours for over. What do I want to swap in for four? What is now my lowest level? 22. Really want Dotler in. Oh, there's level one Darmaka. Probably should worry about him. Yeah, okay. Darmaka, switch for Arctivish. Arctivish, what do we want to swap in over Yeah, we'll put Snob in. Because I want Snob. Okay, so Snob goes there. And then for six, Surfetch swaps with Dotler. Then Surfetch will also move back to this line. And I want you on that. Because I would like to try to get that fighting type. And now we're going to bump some levels up again. Working an extra. Oh, wait, did you not? I, that is some shit. So you don't have a normal 40 hour work week, do you? I, I'm i sorry. Yeah, that just sounds very rough. Right, Darmaka. Let's get you up there. Taunt, bite, avalanche. Sure. A lot of ice typing here. Oh wow, you're attacking special attacks. Outlandishly. You're an emergency services collector? Huh. Oh, so you have. Okay, I, I think I get what that is. Sure. I'll replace that. His workup is actually really nice for Darmaka, apparently. Okay, yeah, so you're spare. But you literally didn't have a day shift spare? That That's just kind of... That's not okay. Because you're night shift spare. Like, at my job, we just don't have night shift spare, so people... Like, if I needed to call out tonight, my guy at work right, or at work, actually right now, because he should have been there about 40 minutes ago, would have to work a full 12-hour shift. 
And if I needed to call out tomorrow, he'd have to come in for an extra full day. Which I don't think he minds. In most instances. Oh jeez, yeah, we need to get everyone up to like 40. I don't know if I can do that in this, can I? to take that over that. Okay, you're still guaranteed a minimum fake check. That is also not bad. But you also, I assume, work a minimum amount, or a max, not a minimum amount, but, like, they do have you set to work a minimum amount. That actually doesn't sound too bad for streamers. <laughs> part-time job where you're paid regardless of if you're there you just have to be on the ready for it all right dotler shiny dotler at that we have a shiny ore beetle finally i got this thing at the very start of this game and i am so happy to see him evolve again oh <laughs> Okay, so they're not allowed to schedule you for more than 24 hours in advance because they need... Okay, so your schedule can be very chaotic. Alright, so we just keep bumping up a little bit. Whoever's lowest gets the most uproar. What I teach you uproar? Okay, so you would have nights, not just, not, not nights and days, essentially. Yeah, I can get that. Trying to do nights and days. You don't have very good damage stats, but you are defensive as all mess. Aren't you, Ore Beetle? Hmm. That's not actually... Keep those, so I think I'll get rid of round, keep confusion. War Beetle also hasn't learned very much moves wise in a while. Alright, so. Boltund. There, hey, there we go, there's your stats improving. Boltund has a very. Yeah, his attack stats are very specific. He needs bite attack, because apparently he's strong jaw. Five, yeah. And what's my lowest puzzle now? Psychic definitely will be a good. Do I want both of these? Probably. Yeah, like having to work nights and go into days is kind of why I'm looking at other jobs as well as. Uh, yeah, sure. Give it to you. As well as other aspects of what I'm doing as a job. Feed them. Yeah, sure. Maka. Belly drum. Ooh, belly drum? Okay. You have okay defenses. It's not going to work here, but belly drum darmanitan Dar can be really fun. So that's as far as I can go with levels at the moment. <laughs> that's a bit rough, but I think we can manage. Oh, how? Okay, it's a dark type. Oh, it's dark type. I don't know what we're gonna do here. We might actually take a loss on this first attempt. You will see. Like, a loss is not a bad thing, although we might lose some of our... Some of the power that we do actually have. I think Orbeetle's not helpful as a thing. But the evolution definitely was fun. Uh, let's see. Remove 
there anything that you guys could remember that might be a fighting type move? Not really. Go burst? I'm just checking move sets. Okay, you don't learn anything outside of what you do from levels. Does War Beetle have anything behind its level up? Confusion, Struggle Bug, Confuse Ray, Magic Coat. Agility, Psybeam. Beam. Hypnosis. Bug Buzz might be viable here. Uh, I guess I don't really need the status defense buffs. I kind of could use status or damage buffs, really. Morgrum, don't have much. Fake out. Yeah, we're hitting a point where it's just going to be hard to without going and doing raid battles. Yeah, you also have just the same lineup. I usually will do this, then go to TMs and maybe TRs. Electrify? Oh, that's neat. That's kind of cool. I didn't know that was a thing. You can change a Pokemon's type to electric. Although it's not your own, it's a target Pokemon. Let's see. Payday, not fly. Pin missile, not fly. Fire spin. Wave, nah, dig. Nope. I'm trying to think what might be. I mostly need fighting type moves is the thing. Dark and normal are kind of the big deals here. Some poison, so I can use some ground. Yeah, fighting and ground is probably a good pick. So Darmaka at this low of a level might be able to do enough. We'll see. We will see. Here, draw Sand Tomb, no, Bullet Seed, no, it's supposed to be a Rock Blast, nah, Grind, U-Turn, no, Payback, Avalanche, no, I'm gonna Shock, nah, Round, Hex, Retaliate, Bulldoze, Bulldoze, Bulldoze could come in useful. Yeah, you're not bad for that. We'll place Echoed Voice for now. Uh, and learn bulldoze instead. Tail slap, green kiss, false swipe, nope. Smart strike. Huh, that's lame. Trying to find her options. Low kick. Low kick on Morgrim. Yep. Could also teach someone earthquake. I feel like that's a bit much. That's a plot. Do this instead of Sucker Punch. I think that'll work out. Planning on the attempt at the Dark type gym. No one can learn Earthquake. You already have that. Focus Energy. Nah. Reversal. No, no one can use it. Sky Shock. Nah. Horn. Front Shadow Ball. Not really. Future Sight. No. Nope. Heat Wave. Heat Wave. Not here. Cosmic power. Maybe water bulk up. Forest sphere? Nope. No one can learn that. It's just a, some of these are just not an option. Storage? Nah. Not for now. Electro ball. That might, because I think Bolt Hunt has really good speed. 
It has pretty good speed. Punch, nuzzle. Yeah. We'll replace nuzzle with that just for something that can hit kind of hard. Ally switch, scald, work up, wild charge. Okay. Yeah. Item, Bolton. I just needed to put better move sets on Bolton, apparently. Because he was not doing well last time. Drill rod. Someone, can someone do that? Nope. Heat crash, none of hurricane darkest lariat, high horsepower, throat chop. Maybe. This actually might come in handy because throat chop might stop uh, Dude Buddy from doing thing. Because he is a musician and might have a lot of sight sound based moves. Psychic, psychic fangs. That's not useful here, though. Body press? Yes, actually. He has really good defense. I will put it over light screen for now. And we'll see how this goes. Yeah, okay. Now we'll go take on our Darkness Gym with this group. Not confident yet. It's just the front entrance. Hello. Oh, you are. The shutter closed. Nobody's going to be able to challenge the gym. I got to look into this. Just happened to have too many of these, so I'll give you one. Okay. Oh, here's his lead card. It is the gym leader, Pierce. And here begins the gym challenge. If you're looking for the gym leader, he's straight ahead from here. All right. Yep. We're just taking challenges. Give me a minute. I need to... All of a sudden, getting a headache. Challenged by Team Yell Grunt. Oh, Lanou. Alright. Berserker. Oh. Level 42. Iron Head. Effective. Fury Swipes. Okay. Sure. Sure, Fury Swipes. Keep just fluctuating a head headache. Probably need to go get my water. Actually, yeah, we'll do that real quick. Be right back. Okay, I'm back. Just had to fill from it around the corner. All right, we're back into it. We're just waiting on everyone to grow. If we can get any evolutions in here, we'll be pretty solid. But there's no guarantee. Go forward and oh, hello. Oh, hello. Oh, he's gonna. Well, that's a Cantonian Mr. Mime, too. Like, that's not even a Galarian Mr. Mime. How did you guys get that? All right, miss. Take you on. Fine. Oh, evil. All right. I think we got this. Yeah, I keep doing this, but I'm going to take the headset off for a minute. Just 
to hopefully get rid of this headache. But you know, what I usually do for headaches is drink water, turn off the sound, and kind of cry and relax about it. But water is because often enough I will dehydrate myself forgetting to drink water. Especially if I don't have my big uh, water bottle that is nowhere nearby. Mr. Mime, you gonna let me through, buddy? Bari Bari. <laughs> yes, go that way. Very good. I'm healing for no reason. Alright, double battle? Double battle. Legs hurt from that lantern. <laughs> I can imagine you jumped out of a window, buddy. Oh, Scrafty. You're fighting a perk, so you might actually stand a chance against Berserker. Might not. Scrafty used Brick Rate. It's gonna hurt. Yeah, Berserker is definitely handling this for me. Actually, are you guys hearing a bad audio feed because of that? Move that further away so there's no big echo. Because I've had that issue happen before. You know, sometimes when I'm streaming, I forget I have very long hair. <laughs> because the headset holds it back and down for me pretty well. I do need to probably get a headband? Hairband? Like that. Oh, they crushed the boxes. I didn't even realize that. That's cute. Max Revive. Which I don't need to use one. I don't need to use that, but let's heal up Berserker a little bit. So he can handle the rest of the way through. Maybe. I don't think any of these doors open, by the way. Hello, Mime. Let me back off again. HP of your Pokemon. <laughs> okay. Acrobats? Hi. Congrats to that back handspring so much. Even a pop star would be jealous of those moves. Don't be surprised. Oh, I'd be surprised. I mean, I was a little surprised. Like, that's probably the best animation cycle they've put into this game. You animated a handspring. Like, fucking hell. I think that was a handspring. It, it might just be a backflip. No, a backflip wouldn't be like that. So yeah, that would be a back handspring. Your ice-type Pokemon has no merit here. As my one Pokemon waltzes through most of your team. This is a It's over already, what? Huh? Now, the real challenge is actually going to be Pierce. I should have been practicing my battle skills, not my backflip skills. Yeah, that's fair. Yeah, like, that's probably the neatest and most interesting version of an animation they've put together for this game. They just backflip. Alright. Hi. Team Yell takes the field. This might be the gym challenge, but I won't let you ruin our cool secret hangout. Alright, time for a pick pincer attack. All right. So, are we double battling again? Oh, yeah, he's... Yeah, Team Yell is actually made up of Spike and the gym trainers. Yeah, you're... That's fair. It's funny, because you get to see both versions. Like the gym trainer and Team Yell Grunt. Oh, gym trainer Joshua. Okay, so they are the same. Like, they're same, but different. It's funny. Enough. Go for 
We're gonna do this, even if it hurts my uh, Berserker. Bulldoze will help in the long run. Six spikes. Okay. Not good damage. Speed down. Speed down. Speed down. So three speed downs. No. Oh. Separate speed downs is not bad. And now we can just hammer into Rapion. Or Beetle. Nah, not do that for now. Ooh, Frisk. I didn't realize he had Frisk. That can be useful. And Drapion, Freeze Dried. Freeze Dried Scorpion. Oh, and he's frozen. Nice. And he immediately thought out. Not so nice. Result is immediately poisoned. Berserker, go. There we go. Double battle's fun. Yeah. It, it, it's not a big secret that they are both... Like, they're part of both teams there. Because Team Yell is not, the, not different from... The gym trainers of Spikema. Either way, whatever. Our gym leader's up next, but he's really strong. Got that? I mean, everybody already knew the true identity of Team Yo, right? It means I won't get in trouble for not getting my disguise on, right? I sure hope so. I mean, yeah, it seems like it would be quite understandable. Alright. Uh, don't. Oh. Okay. I don't have just a basic poison heal. That's fine. But, this. Dark result should be fine. Don't really need to save at the moment. Alright, Marnie, what you got? Shut your gob. <laughs> oh, Redris. Uh, I'm really sorry. A lot of. The lot from Spike Mouth's telling me they locked down the city for my sake. Spike Mouth's just keeps getting worse and worse, and all Pierce does. All Pierce says is don't worry. So. We decided to disguise ourselves as Team Yell and sabotage the other challengers. We thought if we could stop the other gym challengers from reaching the gym, then Miss Marnie would be the only one to win and make it to the Champion Cup. We figured that it would increase the chances of our wonderful Miss Marnie becoming the new champion. So that's no way to help someone at all. You do need to just get stronger. Or there's no need to bother with the preparations or whatever. Go on in and face the gym leader. I mean, we made it this far. We're ready for him. Alright, Pierce. Hi. Alright. Let's go. Okay, you. I oh, am. Yeah. I don't need the Cantonian Mr. Mine, but thank you for the offer. I've already registered a Cantonian Mr. Mime. Hey, Pierce. Oh, yeah, he has good music. Oh, wait. Why are they booing him? Sigh. So you're finally here, huh? I see. I'm, I'm really not... A great gym leader. Figured that's why nobody was coming to challenge me. Good ears, so I ever heard the whole thing about the city being shut up. When I was alone, it was like my soul was weeping. It's a simple gym stadium we can't even Dynamax or Pokemon, but well, I still hope you enjoy the battle. Like, the whole city is your gym. Like, it's interesting. Everyone just off to the side. Now then, 
the gym leader of Spike Mouth Pierce, the dark type user. You want to challenge me even though you know you'll lose? This Then this song's for you, foolish trainer. Get ready for a mosh pit with me and my party, Spike Myth. It's time to rock. Like, it sounds like they're booing, right? Oh. You're challenged by Gym Leader Pierce. Let's go. Gym Leader Pierce out. Scrafty. Hi, Scrafty. Let's get this damage going. Everyone cheer on my Pokemon. Let's do it. Scrafty, intimidate the opponent. I mean, yeah, that's just his ability. Nice little opening gambit, though. Wait, fake out means I can't make it. Yeah. Because I flinched. Sand attack. Actually, my accuracy goes up from Hone Claw, so yeah, that's perfectly fine. I needed one attack boost, and accuracy up is not hurt. Sand attack, yeah. Pierce is probably one of my favorite gym leaders from this game, just because even when he can Dynamax, he chooses not to. He just opts out of it because it's not what he can do at his gym, so he can't do the same thing here. Sand attack this late into the game is also painful. Because I, I can't really do anything about it at the moment. I need a fighting type attack to go up against Scrafty. We, we can probably do this as the thing. Okay, press. I'm gonna take a chance on Orbeetle. He's got good defenses. He is also shiny. I love bringing up. Oh, Orbeetle's faster. Okay. All right, body press. Not bad damage. Sand attack. Yeah. I have a move. I think that can auto hit. Right. New effect. Mirror coat. Oh, special. Yeah. Okay. Counter and that are the up opposed. Like. Yeah, that, that makes sense. But he's also likely not to hit with... Not to swing at me with special attacks until maybe Obstagoon, Morgrim... Malamar. Malamar. Not, I don't remember his typing. That's fine. Orbeetle will be fine. We'll just keep body pressing because Orbeetle has outrageous defense. Malamar's gonna mess you up with his contrary ability. Oh, eh, okay. Bug Buzz would have probably been the better option. I missed. Oh, uh, right. Ooh, boy. Bug Buzz. All right. We're getting. We're we're going. We're going at it here. I love my Ore Beetle so very much. Obstagoon. Okay. I'm gonna try a body press on Obstagoon. If it doesn't go through, we'll low kick. Face the proud high roar of my Obstagoon. I think he's very fast, though. Yep, there's a number I had saved just for this. You lot in the stands better cheer me on. Throat chop. Yeah, kind of figured. That's fine. Need another fighting type move. See, this is where it becomes kind of an issue. Because I think he's gonna start one shotting Pokemon. Struct? What does that do again? Oh, yeah, it's a defensive move. That makes sense. And. Oh, it brings down my defense. Not okay. What are you gonna swing at me with? Oh, Morgrim's faster? Alright. Oh, wait, no. You, yeah. Should have figured. I 
I'm hit him one more time, I think. At least try. Alright, Morgrim down. We can do this. It's just gonna take. I'm gonna try and brick break. But I don't know if Darmok is going to be able to even withstand a hit. Okay, obstruct. That is fair. Oh, so Darmaka looks a lot bigger than I expected. Chop. Yeah. Okay. I have a plan. Might not be a good one, but it's a plan. Result. Yeah, that's fine. This work. I just want to see how much damage this is going to do. Not a lot. Not a lot. Failed. Okay. Wild Charge. I think Wild Charge does actively... I think it gives me a speed up sometimes. Either that or it's the Flame Charge. Oh, it also damages the user a little. Alright, Bolton. You just aren't good, and I don't get why. You don't do... You don't do... Bollocks damage. Alright. Result. I thought there was going to be more poison in here. That's why I wanted the ground type move on him. What are going to do? We're going to try for Orbeetle. Orbeetle is going to be our last stand, as it were. Actually, let's put Berserker in as well. Counter, yeah. Right, you have reactive moves. I kind of forget about that. I'm trying to freeze him. There's the obstruct. Freeze dry. Does it reduce my defense there, too? It doesn't, so it just has to be a physical attack. So special attacks is, are not a bad play here. Give me that freeze. Nope. Struct again, that's fine. I think we've got this at the moment. Granted, we would have lost if not for Revival Herbs, which honestly says a lot about the item being as good as it is. And easy to obtain. Alright, Obstagoon down. Regardless here. Berserker started out strong, it's just that I couldn't get hits off against him, his early monster. I don't really use sound type moves, so... Like, Throat Chop is okay. Throat Chop definitely would be really good early on. Alright, what you got? Skuntank. Uh, keep current Pokemon. Berserker probably should have been taught a ground-type move at this point. Thinking about it, I don't do Encores, get it? I mean, you're gonna have to. If I lose here, I kind of have to come challenge you again. Sucker Punch and Toxic. I think he's lying. What we're gonna do is home calls. Oh, fence down. All right. Get me stacked. Attack Rose, attack. Accuracy Rose. Iron Head once. Yep, kind of figured. Sucker Punch. Oh, wow. You did good damage there. Okay. Um, ah, this is... Oh, okay. Let's see. Strategy might be going with Arc Dissolve try and get the ground type attack. This isn't gonna work out. Is Skuntank dark? Yeah, it's dark. Um, hmm. Try Bug Buzz. Sucker Punch. Yeah. It's 
a lot of damage. It's also a fair amount of damage. All right. Special didn't go down. Arctazolt, you actually might be the savior here. Sucker punch again. Oh, Screech. Okay. Yeah, I was I was curious how that was gonna go. Alright, Arctazolt. Sucker Punch only has five hits in it, so after that it's just whatever. Bulldoze. You slowed down. You are, but that doesn't really hurt that much. I think we win this if it's not a crit. There we go. There we go. And Skuntank down. We got him. And that's why I thought we needed a poison type move, or a ground type move. Sounds good. We defeated Gym Leader Pierce. <laughs> Me and my team gave it our best. Let's meet up for a battle again sometime. Sure. I got gotcha. you. We'll get to it. Alright, Pierce. I'm glad we were able to battle. Seems like my Pokemon feel the same way. Give me your gym badge and let me go. Is your dark badge. Oh, They're all sad about it. I mean... Me getting the badge does not hinder Marnie in any way, shape, or form. I'm just, you can now catch Pokemon up to level 55. Here's a uniform, too. I've actually been thinking about just selling them at my concerts. You got a dark uniform. I mean, I imagine a lot of people would be fine. My little sis Marnie is going to challenge me next, I bet. Oh, there she is. That was actually kind of sweet. So you're watching, sis? You won't learn anything from seeing me lose. I was watching your battle, bro. That's how I learned to battle and all of that. That's right. That reminds me. That reminds me, Marnie, there's something I wanted to tell you. I want you to take over the gym here in Spike Mouth as his gym leader. Yeah, I know. You plan to retire after the Champion Cup, right? I think you've really become a great gym leader, If you, even if you don't Dynamax your Pokemon. I love you, but my answer is a big fat no. I mean, when I end up becoming champion, I won't be able to be a gym leader. Good point. In that case, let your big bro see if you have the skill to be a champion. Hey, Redris, thanks for having an amazing battle. Amazing. Thanks for having an amazing battle with my brother. It's my turn next, so clear off for a bit, okay? I'm out. <laughs> we good. We're done here. You seriously beat Pierce? Here, uh, TM to remember this moment. Snarl. Snarl's actually a pretty good move. Hey, there's some trouble over on Route 9. It's so bad even the champions come to sort things out. Hey, you, you gave Pierce a thrashing, didn't you? You should head over there to help. Come on, then. I'll show you the way. Huh? Oh, I don't even get a choice here. But I was gonna go and change out my team. Well, I can go wherever I am. Ba boom! Hey, champ. What's up? Redris, thanks for coming. I've got a lot on... I've got a handle on this. Whatever's making that noise, I'll see to it. I already told you, didn't I? Keep your eye on the goal. And for you, that's winning the gym challenge. The only gym badge left is the one you'll get from the Dragon Gym's leader, Rihan, right? Rihan is the only trainer out there I consider a real rival. He's that good, you know? And there I go again. Sorry, I suppose this is no time for me to be stopping for a chat. There's a bit of trouble here with my name on it. Don't you worry about a thing. The unbeatable champion is here to look after things and keep you all safe. Another kaboom. Or at least try. I came from the tunnel, wouldn't you say? Seems that I'm about to have a champion time. Oh well. Cool. What do we got? Team cycle real quick. Actually, we'll 